All right, we just had two uh, snow days. We had back-to-back -back snow days. That never happens. Well, I guess this year it happened twice, <laughs> but rarely does that happen. So I hope you had uh, a good couple days. Now, this week, we're gonna be starting our first unit, which is the pieces of the geographic puzzle. Uh, you're gonna be a little geographic inquiry person, uh, kind of bringing in all those things that hopefully over uh, the grade nine year and grade 11 year that you kind of uh, ingrained into how we study geography. So. For the minds on, you are going to watch the YouTube video that looks at the country of Nauru. Sorry about that, I'm out here with my dog and my dog almost just took out my whole tripod. So, you are going to be looking at the country of Nauru and we're gonna look at a boom and bust period. So, a country that had a ton of resources that they didn't quite, you know, manage it properly and now it's completely depleted and the effects on the country. You're gonna to try to come up with a couple examples for that in Canada. And if you look at the content on the hub underneath that section, I've given you a couple ideas that you could look at uh, for Canada in terms of gold, cod, lumber, right? How did Canada kind of push that resource a little far? And, you know, even though Canada's been doing pretty good with managing our resource, but there's lots of examples. Lobster right now is one where we are not doing the best job uh, managing it. That's what you're going to look at. So the mine's on. You're looking at the country of Nauru and how they manage their resources, and you're gonna find one for Canada. Second thing we're gonna to try to accomplish this week is the action section of the uh, first piece of content. And for the action section, you are going to look at the patterns and trends, so the pattern of a resource in Canada. The pattern I'm gonna recommend is gold. Lots of gold in Ontario and Quebec, right? We always think of gold maybe being up north. Lots of gold in Ontario, Quebec. I want you to look at the pattern, right? How is that laid out in Canada? And there's gonna be a number of words that you gotta to try to incorporate into your uh, explanation, but you're gonna see that on the hub. And if you are a person who is in class, we're gonna do lots of maps as well to try to learn all the countries of the world. So when we talk about places like Nauru, you actually know where we are talking about. Okay, so this week, minds on and action. I'll show you real quick right now where you are finding that on the hub, but that's gonna be it. Hopefully, uh, I am seeing a lot of you in class, so you might be hearing this uh, twice. All right, guys? So this week, minds on, action. We'll do the consolidation next week for this content. Later, guys. I'm off for my hook with my dog.